freaking what dude that looks awesome what the heck what's up youtube laughing pikachu here what are you doing how are you doing today that was my attempt at dabbing but i just sort of like did some weird salute things i'm in my pajamas right now don't judge me it's just it's gonna be a great day anyways first of all i apologize that today's video is going up late i just i wanted to make sure all the leaks were out and all the information was out and i was i do i was Honestly, I was just asleep this morning and I just I just woke up. Shh. Anyways, today they released a lot of new things. You know, there's a lot of new cards, a lot of new leaks, and on top of that, we have some boost pack images of the new Burning Shadows set. There's just lots of stuff to react to. But rather than just doing a normal little like news video that I typically would do, instead I'm gonna be doing like a news reaction thing. So I'm gonna be reacting, filming my reaction to some of the new cards because I haven't seen all of them yet and I am excited to see what these sets look like. Uh, basically this video is mainly gonna be talking and showing you guys about, talking to you guys about and showing you the new Burning Shadows cards also known as SM3, which is a Japanese set that is releasing tomorrow. Um, so yeah, let's do it. Okay, so first of all, there's a couple of articles. We're on Pokebeach.com, which is like your top source for new stuff because Pokemon news. All right, so here's the uh, first one. It talks about Shining Mew. Let's just take a look at all oh, these look gorgeous. Okay, so this was the set that's supposed to be releasing on July the 15th. And the I think we also have booster pack images. Oh, yo, that looks epic. <gasps> do, you, do you see that? Do you, Shining Ho-Oh. That's actually, that looks really cool. And, oh, no freaking, wait, that's, I didn't even know that, I did not know that was a thing. So we're getting a Pikachu promo card in the blister. Oh, do you see this thing in the back, yo? There's like a jumbo ho -oh. oh, wait. I kinda, instead of buying booster boxes, I might actually get this instead. I might get like a case of these. These look epic. Okay, so there's that. So first of all, basically this article is talking about the SM3 Plus set, which is going to be releasing in July. And then they also showed us um, the in July 1st, they're going to be releasing this jumbo thing with the Ho-Oh and the beautiful Pikachu card. Okay, so there's the first article. Pretty cool, pretty cool. But we aren't even into the good stuff yet. What is this? Uh, yeah, I don't, I'm not gonna read all that. That's, that's great. You guys read it yourself. I, I don't know how to read. All right, Burning Shadows. Ooh, Booster Pack, Theme Decks, Blisters, Elite Trainer Box Images. <gasps> Yo, I have not seen these yet. Okay. So first of all, here is the, like, the jumbo, I don't know what even to call this, the display thing that you would see at, like, Walmart. So they have both of the, the both of the theme decks. Looks like it's going to feature Lycanroc and Alola Ninetales. And then we just have some random booster packs. That looks cool, though. All right, booster box. Oh, that's pretty. By the way, guys, if you would like to pre-order a booster box, they are available at OverTheTopTCG.com, and you can do bulk trade-in for that, too. Oh, these are the theme decks, and ooh, Burning Shadow Elite Trainer Box. Yo, this thing actually looks pretty freaking nice. I like the color of it. It's like a dark blue. It looks like professional looking, like, for, for me personally, I was not a huge fan of, like, the mustard colored Elite Trainer Box from the previous set. Oh, look, we got a new, we got a new coin thing. So the single pack check lane blisters are going to have Komala, Komala, and Jangmo O. And then for the triple pack blisters, we have Alone with Meowth and the Cosmog. And then you get three packs and then you get the coins. And we have blister packs. Wow, those look nice. Ho-Oh. Wait, yo, I like these. I'm surprised they didn't include Charizard as one of the booster pack images, but I'm glad they didn't. There is a hyper rare and full art Charizard that's going to be in this set, but I'm actually kind of glad they didn't include it. Because, you know, Charizard's amazing, don't get me wrong, but... You know, I'm glad they're giving some some of the other Pokemon some love. Okay, so here's what the set looks like. Let's just go through this. So we have a Gliscopod GX. That actually, it looks interesting. I wasn't, I mean, it's I've seen better cards, but it's not bad. <gasps> There's Pikachu and Raichu. That's, that's cute. <gasps> you know what we can do? We can bring back Pika Pack. <gasps> you know what? I might do that. I might do that. That Pikachu is gorgeous, by the way. We can pull, we can bring back Pika Pack. Yo, and then there's a monkey in the set too. There's a Semipore. What if we did, like, a little Pika Pack series, and if we pulled Semipur, we would have to do something bad, and if we pulled a Pikachu, we would get to eat something good, or something like that. Or we can do, like, dares. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll get thinking. We'll we'll make some sort of interesting series with this. Continuing on, we have a Toxicroak Hollow. Oh, yo, look at that. Nac Nacrozoma. I probably said that wrong, but that looks cool. Nacrozoma GX. Cool, cool. We have Rhyperior. Oh, Marshadow. That, I like that Pokemon. That looks cool. 
We have the Gardevoir, which I did a whole reaction video to that. You know, that, <laughs> you know my opinions about that, but, uh, oh, Beware is so adorable. Okay, let's get to the good stuff, though. I'm looking for the full arts. Oh, okay, I have not seen these full arts yet. The only ones that I saw is the Charizard and the Charizard Hyper Rare. Everything else is completely new. Okay, so Marshadow GX full art looks pretty nice. I'm not a huge fan of the brown background. Oh, here's the first time I'm seeing the Gardevoir. Why are they making all the Gardevoirs look exactly the same? They always have purple backgrounds. Why? 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 Like, at least make, like, a freaking rainbow. I, I don't know. Just do something. Ooh, look at that. Guzma. That's, that's, I like the background to that. He looks interesting. Cool, cool. We also have a wiki, I think is how you say it. Yeah, wiki. Yep. Yeah, that looks right. Okay, so another uh, trainer card. Then we have a Gliscopod GX Hyper Rare. That looks cool. I like that. And then, oh, here's the cool stuff. Um, So there's Ho-Oh, which, by the way, low-key, ho is my favorite. I think I like it a little bit more than the Charizard card, honestly. And then we have the new trainer card, and we have the Hyper Rare. So there's the hy Hyper Rare necrozoma gx and i think we'll be seeing oh and then here's the secret rares wait 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 wait. i just skipped a section okay so there's a marshado gx hyper rare which we don't have pictures of yet it looks like but we do have the gardevoir hyper rare oh wait yo that looks kind of cool and then we have secret rares. what are they super scoop up okay okay i i mean that's cool rescue stretcher i like that one i think that one looks nice and then oh you get a fairy energy in this set that's awesome. Okay, okay. So continuing on, here's the second set. Did you see the Fighting Rainbow? Because in Japanese, there's going to be splitting up SM3 into two separate sets. Um, so this is the set with the ho -Oh in it and stuff like that. So we have Vileplume. We also have the Charizard GX. I have a feeling this set, to be honest, is going to sell a lot better than the other set. That's just my opinion, but we'll see what happens. ho -Oh GX, that looks freaking gorgeous. Oh, I, love, I really like that set. And, and... Um, also, if you get first edition Japanese boxes, apparently all of them come with some sort of full art card. So that's cool. Uh, Lucario, we have Alolan Muck. Yo, this card looks cool. I'm excited to see what the full art looks like because that looks cool. Uh, we also have the Rebombi. Okay, okay. Oh, Neuvern GX. Wait, yeah, I like this set a lot better <laughs> than the other one. Like, don't get me wrong, the other set's really cool too. But personally, uh, I think this card, this set is my favorite. Charizard GX, okay. We also have the ho -Oh GX. That looks... I really like that card. Alolan Muck. Oh, wow. That actually... That looks cool. I like that, too. I say that for about all of them, but I really... Okay, yeah. Not a huge fan of the Neuvern GX, but, you know, that's just my taste. Uh, we have the... Kiawi. That's the trainer card in the middle. I think that's how you say it. Yeah. I like this a lot better. We have Pulmarina. Okay, that looks cool, too. Oh, yo, look at these hyper rares. We have the ho -Oh hyper rare. That looks really nice. And we have Alolan Muck. Okay. And we have Escape Rope. Yeah, okay. I like this set a lot better. Muscle Dumbbells. That looks cool. And we have, oh, we skipped it. Ah, scroll up. We have the Fire Energy, which I, oh, yo, that looks cool too. Okay, so those are the sets. That's Those are both the sets, including the secret rares and hyper rares. And I think it looks pretty freaking nice. So, anyways, I'm I'm happy with that. I'm happy with how that looks. Okay, these are just more leaks. Uh, let's see. Powerful promos. What's this about? Lorantis, Tapu Bulu, Tapu Coco. What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh, oh, that's another thing talking about, like, playability and stuff. Which is not really my thing. Uh, but if you guys are interested in that, you can go read it. Oh, new Pokemon Center deck boxes. Playmats and sleeves. Let's look at this. What is this? I don't know. Oh, are these Charizard? Yo, that looks really cool. And we have a Raichu one. That is cute. That's cute. That's cute. Oh, and we got Pikachu. What's up, my man Pikachu? Oh, we got Sudowoodo Snorlax. And we got a Pikachu just munching on stuff. That, these are cute. Um, They're hard to get, though. If you don't live in Japan, they're, like, hard to get. But that's cool. I like them. Cool stuff, cool stuff. Uh, I think that is about it. Let me just very quickly sort of just skim through this, make sure... Oh, Pokemon Gold and Pokemon Silver is coming to a virtual console in September. Also, um, there was a Pokemon Direct thing that happened. Oh, here's another thing I wanted to talk about. SM4. So this is the next Japanese set. For some reason, they're already announcing the next set because the current set isn't even out yet. And they're already announcing the next one. But it's SM4, and it actually it looks really interesting. Um, I'm excited to see that. It releases on September the 15th. 
Uh, so we have a while, but you know, that's okay. They're just, they're just getting ready early and just, we just aren't going to judge them. We're just going to let them live, you know, cause don't live, just judge, you know? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, continuing on. Uh, we ha do have box images for the Serena GX box, which I actually, yeah, we actually already saw this and talked about this in a previous video, but I'll quickly show you guys in case you haven't seen it yet. There's a Serena GX box. There's also a shiny Tapu Koko GX box. On both of this one's releasing July the 14th, so like next month this time. And we also are getting new Battle Arena decks with the Landers and the Genesect. And then that is about it. So anyways, guys, let me know. Do you prefer the normal news update? Do you prefer seeing my face in it and my reactions and my hands are moving around like this? What is this? I don't know. Thank you for watching, though. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.